Okay. That didn't take long. We're legal. So this is new, right? This is the new rule on, on no. registering? We've always done this. But we usually did it at the other Yeah, so the office. La Posa South um, building is closed, I guess. So we had to come across the street and get our stickers here. So we're good for two weeks. Good. $40, two weeks. You have to have the license plate numbers on your vehicles. And they take down your name and address and all that stuff. So we're done. We're good for two weeks. Awesome. Now we can go to the show. <laughs> Well, we found a spot. It is kind of hard to find spots in here sometimes, but you have to uh, get creative. It's not hard to find a spot if you have a smart car. Because <laughs> it's smart. So this is day two of our meet and greet. Day two. We're excited to go see how many people are in there. We need a little red one. A little red scooter? A little red scooter, and then we can just come in on the scooter. All right, end of the show. We had so much fun at the meet and greet oh, this year. My goodness. It was, you guys are all so awesome. Yeah. You all came and, and we just were, it was constant. Yeah. We always had somebody to talk to and it was just, it was amazing. Yeah, we didn't count, but we did a quick count on the pictures and we had well over 140 people show up. <laughs> You know, in the five days, we were there for five days. Yeah, and uh, that's not even including some people that walked by and yeah. said, we love your channel and yeah. all this, so thank you. We love meeting you guys, yeah. and we love swapping stories with you and, 
and trying to answer some of your questions and then we end up with having questions and yeah. you know it's just it's just a lot of fun yeah. and oh yeah by the way we have to first thank lion energy for allowing us to use their booth. Uh, they were so gracious in letting us use their booth this year. They're just the neatest guys in that booth. Yeah. And Brian, you are, we love you. You know that, you're like our brother now. Yeah. No, we had we had so much fun. And then while we were having the meetup, we kind of got surprised one day. Yeah. Some special friends showed up. Ricky and Denise from Soaring Together, we weren't expecting them. No, we haven't seen them for a, for quite a while. And, yeah. Oh, to see their faces again and hug them. It was They're just great people. So we cool. love them. They're, yeah. yeah. And then Todd and Sheila from Switch It Up just <laughs> kind of popped into the into the booth. We're talking to, to, to some, some of you, and, and I look over and I look again. I'm like, <laughs> Sheila. We, last we knew they were in Tampa, we had no idea they were flying up to Quartzsite. Oh, but anyway, no. they... We're uh, so good to see you guys. They popped oh in and, and we really appreciate them yeah. stopping by and saying hello. We got to, to catch up a little bit. You know, they had to go, go, go. It was they way had, too short. They had an airplane to catch, but yeah. uh, we had a good time and we're going to get together down the road. So anyway, uh, the, the camp, the Quartzsite camp has oh been amazing gosh. this year. It's, it's spread huge. It's spread out a lot more than it was <laughs> in the past. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know. Last I heard, we had over 26 HDTs in the camp this year. Wow, I mean a lot, and we have a great spot here. Yeah, we're just we have so much room. Yeah, but we didn't come to the desert just for the quartzite show, did we? No, we didn't. And we, you know, we're only here for 10 days, so it's a really quick trip. We got us some riding in. Yeah, so <laughs> the Can Am hasn't had its legs stretched since we left Montana back in October. No, and it's a different type of riding in Montana than it is here. So. I needed to get it out. I needed to stretch it. And I was talking to some of the guys, some of the, I'm going to call them experts because they're experts on, on side by sides. That's right. And um, they were telling me that I needed to blow out my uh, clutch and belt housing on the Can Am. They were filthy. Man, that thing was so filthy. And so much even, dust. Now you know. Now, now I you know. know you can go and clean them and yeah. make sure they're okay. Now I know. So anyway, I told him I needed to get out on a short ride and stretch out the legs on the Can Am. Yeah. And we jumped in the rig and, and went with um, Mark and Jen and Randy and Bobby. Yeah. And off we went. And we were just going to do, I thought we were just going to do a quick up hogs back and back down hogs back and back to camp, but no. Remember Gilligan's Island, a three hour tour? <laughs> we were supposed to have a one hour and it- Turned into three. It turned into three. <laughs> but it was fun. Yeah, it was.
So anyway, that was Can-Am ride number one, and we've actually gotten another one in, and we're thinking of doing a third, so stay tuned, we'll, we'll catch you up on that. But, again, we've got to talk about meeting all you guys at the show. It, we, it was amazing, and we love showing your pictures on TV. I hope you guys yes. don't mind, but, you know, we just had so many people come out. Well, it's been an outstanding show. Today's actually the last day of the show, isn't it? I think so. It's yeah, Sunday. It, today is the last day of the show. Yeah. So we've had an absolute blast, you guys. Um, like Kelly said last week, when you come to Quartzsite, you either love it or you hate it. And there really is no in between. No, no. If you, They'll say, oh, it's okay. Yeah, they don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> But we have thoroughly enjoyed our time out here at Quartzsite yeah. this year. Uh, we got a couple of days of some hard rains. Uh, it's actually kept the dust down. The mm. weather, other than that, has been beautiful. Yes. Uh, it's been in the high 60s to low 70s most of the time and just really enjoying ourselves. And we have had, literally, guys, we really had an enjoyable time at the meet and greet. We, we've got to do more of those. That's oh, all there is to it. We do. We do. But, you know, Lion Energy, again, I want to thank them because they were so generous and just, I mean, we had space, that big, huge space so you all can come and say hi. Yeah. But we love talking to you guys. We love swapping stories and, and we're going to do it again soon, I promise. All right. So we're hoping to get another ride in before we leave the desert here. Uh, we're actually headed a little bit north from here. Not much. We're going to try some, we've got some new boondock spots that we're going to try out. Uh, here shortly, and, and we've got kind of a fun thing coming up. Uh, yeah, we do, yeah. We're going to share that here the next week or two. Yeah. Uh, we've, we've really got some new stuff coming, and we're really excited about it, and we're, we're really excited to share with you guys um, because it's something we've never done, and, and it's, it's going to be a blast. Yeah, it sounds really cool. So today's the last day of the show. We have seen motorhome after motorhome after motorhome leave the area. We've seen fifth wheels leave. We've seen trailers leave. People are starting yeah. to pack up and go, and it's it's that time. That time, yeah. All right, so we're going to wrap this one up from Quartzsite, Arizona. It all starts with an idea. Take those ideas, turn them into reality, and make some wonderful memories, guys. Like we have. That's right. <laughs> we'll talk to you guys next week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.